Hello everyone, this is Sigs from the Project Craft server. Um, today I'm going to go over drop transfer, since that's the popular question of the week. Alright, so down here I'm going to build a real quick little module for storage. And I guess I'll go ahead and make that three high. For this example, I'm going to grab some hoppers. Ooh, the lag is horrible. Um, one thing you have to remember in Project Craft, if you're using hoppers, um, that you have to cut on all your chest. So to do that, I'm going to type backslash LWC flag hopper on. And then I have to go through all these chests, so the chest will accept the hoppers. Um, it basically just allows the hoppers to pull items from a chest, or allows the hopper to put items into a chest. Um, you have to flag each chest individually, um, single chest or double chest. They both count as a single chest. Um, so for drop transfer, to make this work, you have to do backslash LWC mode drop transfer select. Now what this is going to do is I, it's going to let me select any chest that I want. So I'm going to select this top chest since I've built my nice little holder system. Um, then you're going to have to type and tell it to cut on LWC drop transfer. So it's LWC mode drop transfer on. And it'll tell you that your drop transferring is now on. Um, so we can test that. I'll take my shovel here and just throw my shovel. Um, first thing you'll notice is it didn't go down here on the ground anywhere. What happened is it actually went to this top chest and is now being filtered down here through these chests. Um, and it should be in the bottom chest. Um, so as a practical working example for this, I'm going to go dig. I would use this when I'm tearing up my town. I've got, well, you can't really see my town, but making more plots. So when you're digging an MCMO, MMO gives you all the trash. You can have a way to get rid of it. So, for my working example, that'll be enough dirt um, to give everyone a good idea. I'm just going to run around and collect some of this stuff real quick um, that I just mined out. And that, well, let's go grab this little block here. And everybody needs glowstone. So I'm going to come back, and you're going to see that I'm going to throw this on the ground, but it's not going to go on the ground like it normally would. I'm just going to control Q and throw all this stuff out of my inventory. Um, control Q seems to work better because um, if you try to drag it out of your inventory, you have to double click sometimes or it accepts a count. Um, it just adds to the chest. I tend to prefer the control Q to just throw it out of my inventory. Um, you'll see none of that stuff's ended up on the ground here, so I've actually got it out of my town now. If I go back to my spawn point where we created my drop transfer chest for this example, we will come back and check our chest. Um, I might have thrown enough stuff. Yeah, you can see it's still up here a little bit filtering down into this system. Um, that's because the chest that I selected, I wanted to always keep it clean. Um, that way I can, you know, go mine for hours, and I have tons and tons and tons of chests to just sit here and fill up. Um, but as you'll see, there's no rhyme or rhythm to it. It just dumps it into the chest, and right now it's splitting anything in that chest by 50%. Um, so you fill up both the bottom chest, and it'll fill up these chests, and these chests, and up to here. To cut LWC off to where you can throw items back on the ground to give it to a player or whatever, 
you want to do backslash LWC mode drop transfer off. Um, and typically I like to do this twice just to be sure and come out here and throw a shovel or something to test it to make sure it actually comes out of your inventory. Um, so that's it. There's LWC. I hope everybody liked my video. I hope this works for everyone. Um, if you like it, please comment below or you're welcome to give me any suggestions. We'll talk to everybody on the next video.